how to calculate streamlines. First, let's recall what a streamline is. By definition, a streamline is a curve or a line everywhere tangent to the velocity field. So this streamline at this point is parallel or tangent to the local velocity vector. The same thing is true at any point along the streamline. Now, how do we solve for the equation for a streamline? Let's take an example where we have some streamline that looks like this, and here's a local velocity field. I'm going to do this in only the x, y coordinate system, so we'll consider a 2D streamline where we have u as the x velocity and v as the y velocity. Now we know that since this flow is tangent to the streamline, the velocity component in the x direction would be little u, the velocity component in the y direction will be little v, and we can also think about a little segment along this streamline of distance ds. Well, this will be made up of dx and dy. And you see that these are two similar triangles. They have the same angle here. And therefore, dy dx, the ratio of the, this vertical height to the horizontal height along a streamline, is equal to v over u. Let's do an example. Suppose we're given the velocity vector v equal 3xi minus 3y j. And we want to generate an equation for the streamlines. Here's how I would solve this problem. First, I would use this equation, dy dx along the streamline is equal to v over u. v is negative 3y, and u is 3x. This is u, and this is v. We can write equal to minus y over x. Now we can separate the variables. We have dy over y equal negative dx over x. We can integrate this on both sides. dy over y integral equal negative integral dx over x. This is natural log of y. This is minus natural log of x plus some constant and kind of in hindsight and having done these kind of problems before, let's make the constant minus natural log of c. And the reason I do that is because we have this rule that you would should remember from your math class, namely that natural log of a plus natural log of b equal natural log of a times b. And so if we apply, apply that here, this term will equal minus natural log of cx, since both of them have a minus sign there. So we have natural log of y equal minus natural log of cx. Well, that in turn is equal to the natural log of cx to the minus 1, since uh, also to the side here, we know that natural log of a to the minus 1 is equal to negative natural log a. So that's what we did here. So now we can take the exponent of both sides, e to the natural log of y is just y, and e to the natural log of this cx to the minus 1 is equal to cx to the minus 1, or y equal, this is in parentheses, so y equal 1 over cx, or y equal some other constant over x. That's our solution for streamline. We can pick various constants for this equation. And if you plot these streamlines, they'll look something like this. You'll have flow going something like that, where each of these is a different constant in the equation. And thus, we have solved for a simple streamline.